James Cameron finally speaks out about the submarine accident in Titanic. After the devastatingly unsuccessful search for the missing Ocean Gate Titan submarine on Thursday, Titanic, filmmaker James Cameron has spoken out. Cameron thought the Titanic disaster in 1912 and the terrible tale of the sub were disturbingly similar. Well, I've been down there many times, Cameron told on Thursday. I've made 33 dives and I've actually calculated that I've spent more time on the ship than the captain did back in the day. According to the filmmaker, who also happens to be a submersible designer, Cameron even built a sub that could reach the deepest sections of the ocean, which are three times deeper than the position of the Titanic. In March 2012, he traveled to the Mariana Trench in the Deep Sea Challenger, a 24-foot submersible. Cameron noted that, many people in the community were very concerned about this sub. He said, A number of the top players in the community even wrote letters to the company saying that what they were doing was too experimental to carry passengers. I'm struck by the similarity of the Titanic disaster itself, where the captain was repeatedly warned about ice ahead of his ship and yet he steamed at full speed into an ice field on a moonless night and many people died as a result. And for a very similar tragedy, where warnings went unheeded, to take place at the same exact site, with all the diving that's going on all around the world. I think is just astonishing. It's really quite surreal," he concluded. The missing Titanic tourist submersible, which was carrying five people, has been identified as a debris field, the U.S. Coast Guard said on Thursday. All five people on board are thought to be dead. Inside the vessel were Ocean Gate's CEO Stockton Rush. British businessman turned adventurer Hamish Harding, father and son Shahzada and Suleiman Dawood, who are members of one of Pakistan's wealthiest families. And Paul Henry Nargelet, a former French Navy officer and leading Titanic expert. These men were true explorers who shared a distinct spirit of adventure and a deep passion for exploring and protecting the world's oceans, Ocean Gate said in a statement. Our hearts are with these five souls and every member of their families during this tragic time. Titanic, 25 years later, a National Geographic documentary, was released by Cameron in February. The contentious hypothesis that Jack, played by Leonardo DiCaprio, may have survived by scaling Rose's door in the middle of the icy waters, was discussed in the documentary.